uh, let's start right away with the first one that I would like to announce because that's a Moonblock. It's a new Moonblock Writers Edition of 2023. It is dedicated to Robert Louis Stevenson. Uh, he was born in Edinburgh, Scotland in 1815 and had two great desires, freedom and immerising himself in other worlds. Um, I have it right here. Um, Mr. Stevenson composed essays and travel accounts as well as his legendary adventure stories populated with striking characters whose names continue those ends of shiver down the spines of readers around the world like Long John Silver, Captain Flint, Jekyll and Hyde. Let's have a closer look at the fountain pen. I have it here. Um, the novel Treasure Island was the main inspiration for the fountain pen, as you can see, because the overall shape of the writing instrument and the rings on the cone combine to create an impression of a historic extendable spyglass, as you can see. The black precious resin barrel is decorated with engraved crosses, including a larger X, like the one marking the location of the treasure on a map. The vertical lines on the cap bring to mind the planks of the schooner Hispaniala and a traditional sea chest adorns the cap. Behind the platinum coated clip, the lines converge in a compass rose, while the clip imitates the shape of a laying pin to which the lines of a ship's rigging would be secured. The cap top is crowned with the Montblanc emblem, emblemized with the pirate's symbol, a skull with uh, and crossbones elevated at its center. The cap ring is adorned with an engraving of Stevenson's signature alongside the publication dates of his first work, The Pent Land Rising, that was in 1886. And last but not least, the 18 karat gold nib is rhodium coated and is engraved with fine waves and the title given by the Samoans to the great writer and world traveler to Citala. Hemingway Jones, tell us, what do you think of this new writer's edition by Montblanc? I think it's absolutely brilliant. Um, and many times these come out and they tend to be a little over the top. What I really mm -hmm. like about the Robert Louis Stevenson one is that it's beautiful and elegant all on its own, even mm -hmm. if you didn't know the associations. So it's one I'm really excited about and hope to get my hands on at some point. Um, I'm sure it's, it's a brilliant it's, writer. Uh, what I really like is that is this is that Moonblood did this with their... Yeah, the Jolly Roger there in the middle of the Glacier Star. I, I like that they're confident enough with their branding that they don't mind riffing on it. And doing some different things. A lot of brands are just, they won't touch their logo. But Mont Blanc seems to be out there with uh, having a little fun with it now and again. So it's, it's absolutely beautiful. They're okay with playing around with it. Absolutely. Uh, we have it in stock now. You can order it. We can ship it right away. So if you're interested in it, you can order it with us. <laughs> 